Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In 2024, the Swedish government extended the Swedish Armed Forces mandate to further enhance their military training support for Ukrainian citizens. This expansion builds upon the appreciated assistance provided thus far, with Ukraine welcoming the continuation of ongoing training efforts and the potential to expand previous initiatives. Swedish Minister for Defense Pal Johnson emphasized the value of Sweden's training assistance to Ukraine and highlighted the pressing need for additional training, especially in maritime areas. With this extended mandate, the Swedish Armed Forces can strategically plan training activities throughout the year, ensuring minimal impact on the development of Swedish military capabilities. This expanded mandate enables the Swedish Armed Forces to proactively schedule annual activities and swiftly respond to urgent Ukrainian training needs as they arise. Moreover, it allows for bilateral or multilateral training, whether conducted in Sweden or another EU or NATO member state, and grants Ukrainian units access to Swedish territory. The training program draws from experiences in 2023 and assessments of new training requirements arising from recently formed capability coalitions within the Ukraine Defense Contact Group framework. It is anticipated that over 18,000 Ukrainian students will participate in training activities led by Swedish instructors in 2024. Sweden's ongoing training engagements, including support within the EU Military Assistance Mission for Ukraine, Healthcare and Infantry Training, the Northern European Lithuanian Minesweeper Training Initiative, mine clearance activities in Lithuania, and involvement in Operation Interflex in the United Kingdom, will continue and can now be expanded. Under this extended program, the following training activities may become relevant. Training sessions on military equipment provided by Sweden. Participation in various multilateral training activities similar to Interflex or Interforge. Focusing on amphibious warfare. Training within capability coalitions Sweden is part of, such as maritime education covering amphibious combat techniques, underwater mine clearance within the International Maritime Security Coalition framework, or participation in land mine clearance training under the Demining Coalition for Ukraine. Leadership training including courses for prospective group or platoon leaders conducted by Swedish instructors, as well as tactical training for staff officers. That's all for now. See you later.